Seriously, what is the deal with stadiums and piss troughs? It's disgusting. And who thought they were a good idea? I don't even see a stall in here. Uh, what if I have to take a dump? Everything I do, everything I have done has been for you. Maybe I pushed a little too hard, asked a little too much. But try and remember exactly what's at stake here. In case you hadn't noticed, I'm the one calling the shots. Now give me the apple. I'm not supposed to kill you, but the boss man didn't say anything about fucking you up. The Templars have access to all kinds of satellites and camera systems. We'll need to find a way to mask our digital signature. I keep trying to understand how men like Washington and Jefferson dedicate their lives to the pursuit of liberty and equality, yet have no problem owning slaves. We require no creed, no indoctrination by desperate old men. All we need is that the world be as it is. Gentlemen, I hold in my hand a key. And if this book is to be believed, it will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. You just had to be an hero, didn't you? You and Georgie both. Now you see what it gets you. A pine box and little else. Your meddling in the revolution has caused us no small measure of grief. It cannot continue. Our work is too important. What better wear to peddle than life? Nothing else is as precious or so desperately craved. And no price is too great for the man or woman who fears an abrupt and permanent end. I offered you an olive branch, and you knocked it from my hand. Perhaps you'll respond better to the sword. When we should live forever on castles in the sky. You wield your blade like a man, but your mouth like a child. In time, our holdings will no longer suffice. And that day is closer than you think. We must ensure our people have ample room to grow and further prosper, which means we need more land. I have spent today drawn from one bit of madness to another with nothing to show for it. Before I go any further, I would like to know exactly what it is you intend. Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. She's still the fastest in the Atlantic. Sure, she needs some attention. Minor things, mostly, but with a little affection, she'll fly again. Men came, claiming we had to leave. They said that the land was being sold and that the Confederacy had consented. They sent an envoy. They would not listen. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. But the king sends these red ghosts to push us around. They are not our masters. This is our city. George Washington is brave beyond measure. Loyal like a brother, peerless in character, and unshakable in his convictions. Men with far greater minds than mine will build this country's foundations. A task I am simply not equipped for. Have you played bocce before? I'm really growing quite fond of it. That baton. He shows up in the middle of our preparations and just takes charge. Screams at everyone to advance, and then rides away. I am left to pick up the pieces. The docks are an angry place of late. Protesters picketing the latest shipments of British tea. The eyes of the city are upon that stage. We have an entire army of our own, merely awaiting the order to take up arms. I'm ordering a full retreat. We have lost too many in exchange for too little. If the Tories want this hill so badly, let them have it. Boston is the true prize. Older women cannot conceive, which means one less thing over which to fret. In fact, you also decrease the chance of acquiring something like the French pox, its presence clearly visible, or the woman dead. Is this not why you fight? Is this not why you came here? To ensure more than just your race's future. But it's freedom. 
This world has known nothing but heartache and horror since we left it. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. My psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made, honest mistakes I made over a decade ago.